We are back with a brand new product, a desk toy. Today we have the Force Fluid Desk Toy by Flux Design Lab, originally funded on Kickstarter. And this is a magnetic design, super fluid liquid awesomeness. So this desk toy incorporates ferro fluid, which was originally designed by NASA. And what it is, is iron nanoparticles. I know we're gonna get super scientific here. I don't know. Okay, I kinda know what it means, but <laughs> basically what it is, is it's iron nanoparticles that are encapsulated in little spheres. What that does is it makes these little spheres magnetic and it's supposedly super awesome. My understanding is that NASA originally designed this so that they could control where liquid goes when they're in space. Um, basically with using magnets, they could pull stuff from one area to another. This is more so just super neat. Uh, the video that I saw on Kickstarter for this was like mind boggling. Now, not, not, so, not necessarily mind boggling, but it just looked flipping awesome. So we've got this nice tube, glass and fingerprints galore all over it. Oh, look at this, this just spins around. I'll show you a super up close in just a minute because there's pretty crazy stuff in here that I want you to see. Let's just finish opening up the rest of the box here. So we open up the bottom here, we've got a user guide, and then we've got these two magnets. Ooh. So as you can kind of see, there is a black ball up here at the top, and that is the ferrofluid. I've got these two magnets, rare earth magnets. So super strong. They've got little rubber tips here so they don't damage the glass. So let's pull it down. As you can see, there's a bunch of like little spikes on here, which are pretty nuts. It's heavier than water, so it just naturally drops down to the bottom. But then up here at the top, there is a magnetic screw, is what they say. It will always stay up there as long as you bring it back to the top. They recommend you always keep it up at the top, otherwise it's gonna stain the glass. Oh man, I'm sucking it from one magnet to the other, and then, what? I don't know if you can really tell in the video, but when I have one magnet here holding onto it, it's really spiky. But as soon as I bring two fairly, I mean, they're not totally on the glass, they're a little bit away, but it totally rounds out like just a ball of water or something. I mean, I'm no rocket scientist here, but my guess to the reason why it's doing that is because with one magnet, the iron in there, super pronounced, I guess. Whereas if there's two pulling in opposite directions, the iron doesn't know where to go. I feel like in the Kickstarter video, they had a lot more of this fluid in these tubes than there is now, which is kind of a disappointment. I expected there to be a little more of the fluid in here that you could play around with, because I feel like it's just a little difficult to do truly crazy things with it with this little amount. Oh, there's still more up there. It's like I can't catch it all. This is like space technology that they use. I don't know if, they, if NASA actually uses it or, or whatnot, but it was designed by NASA. Obviously, there's a few things going on with this that I don't fully understand. Like, there's this black fluid that keeps ending up on the outside of the glass. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's supposed to be there, if it's just because of the construction. Maybe it's just like some oil that's used. But that's kind of freaking me out a little bit because I have no idea what it is. Neat little toy. Again, I'm going to have to keep playing with it to see if I can do... Um, more things with it. Holy cow, I feel like I got a lot more this time than I was getting before. The retail price of this Force Fluid desk toy is $39.99. Would I purchase this again now that I've tried it? Um, it's a pretty steep price when I think about it, 40 bucks. You can say, hey, I've got space technology sitting right in front of me. How many times do you think you can say that? Not many. Well, at least I wouldn't think that many. I can't say I would buy it again, but definitely a neat concept. Maybe if you like tinkering with little things. I mean, I like, I fidget a lot, but 
this is this takes like focus to play with i don't really focus on things to play with like the fidget cube if you didn't see that video go check it out maybe you're a rocket scientist and you're like i know exactly what that is i want to play with that on my desk maybe that's you maybe it is maybe this is the toy for you for me i uh, can't say that it is again super neat neat concept neat implementation but i'm still kind of freaked out about it with the, the liquid, the stuff happening all over the place. I don't know how to feel about this product. So I think that's gonna wrap up this video. If you've heard of this stuff before, let me know. I'd like to know, maybe you're a rocket scientist. If you're a rocket scientist, I would love to know that. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, hit that thumbs up, hit that subscribe button. If you wanna to continue to see interesting, unique products you've never seen before, like this uh, force fluid. Magnetic stuff. You never know what kind of technology magnets are going to bring into your life. You never know. We'll see you next week. <laughs> <laughs>